Hey folks, welcome back to Build It with Smith. I'm your host Smith and I'm playing SimCity Build It. Uh, let's take a look and see what's happening in my, in, in my uh, city. If you tuned in on the last episode, we had this area right here that we were working on. This is my new development, so uh, lots of stuff has been coming on. Now, rather, I thought to myself, rather than trying to upgrade, trying to get upgrades, trying to get these little uh, hard hats to come on every single one of these on down the line until I got them to where I want it I figured it probably would be easier just to upgrade whatever options they gave me here as I scroll throughout my city there was a lot of buildings that aren't fully upgraded uh, some of you if you might remember this whole area here was these types of apartment buildings well I've decided to upgrade that area there we go with a notification I knew I should have turned those off but uh, that may be if you looked at some of my videos of the past for some reason I'll lose the sound in in the video matter of fact speaking of sound I've had the music off but let's go ahead and turn the music back on uh, and I think that losing the sound had something to do with having my notifications on. Maybe, I don't know. Anyway, it sucked. But I think I'm gonna upgrade this area here to be these mid-size uh, buildings. And as you can see, I've already got my population up about 35,000 more. And so we're moving away from these small little areas here. This was the kind of mid low income assistance types of housing that we had here and they're getting an upgrade yes and so over here in this section i did have these type these if i can click these types of houses over here and you see they're actually upset because they don't have any parts nearby see that red uh tree sign that means that they want a park nearby but you're not going to be able to get it however we will uh, what we're going to do, I might keep this little area here, this strip here, these types of buildings like that, maybe. And uh, I like these for right there. So I'll probably put some more, probably upgrade these or whatever. So I think what I'm going to do is just kind of move buildings around rather than trying to get the upgrades to fall on specific areas. But I've got some check marks here, so let's go through. Oh, and in addition to what is going on with that, I'm also in the middle of doing a epic building. And I don't know, I'm not gonna try to reach gold, obviously. It'd be nice if I can get silver, but uh, probably not gonna happen. So, oh, well, uh, let's see. Let's see how we can start getting rid of some stuff. Obviously, uh, we've reached the limit at our uh, city storage here. Got a lot of stuff that we need to get rid of. Not a whole bunch of everything, just like one here, two there, stuff like that. I've been collecting uh, these, particularly these uh, Tokyo items so that I can upgrade my little Tokyo town, which is right over here. And as you can see, all the buildings are exactly alike. I can actually put an upgrade to that if I get more ladders. So, let's see, can I? Well, let me go ahead. So, four watches. Actually, if I look around here, there was another place that required watches. This place. So, look, I'd rather get three points than one point. They both require four watches. But you got to be you got to be mindful of these things. So, I'm going to do that and put my watches there. And then, let's see. Before I go and do this... Uh, pie here I want to make sure that none of these other buildings require pie yeah there it is right there so let's make sure before I do the upgrade that because you see some of this area here falls in the premium homes they'll upgrade to premium homes I want all of these everywhere I could possibly find to be luxury homes now I wonder uh, does this tell me how okay this adds 954 to the population. Now I think that this is the same as one of these. Let's see, 803. Well, that's probably because something is affecting the population. These are basically at the same level. It's just that this one is a luxury uh, loft, I guess. 
And this is actually at the same level as the apartments. So, I wonder if you get more population with having a luxury home rather than a premium home or, for that matter, a standard home. I wonder if there's a difference. Because if you look at these, the maximum population for a residential uh, deal is 836. Well, actually, I can answer that right now because that doesn't, the 836 that they say doesn't factor in uh, the population boost. See, this would be the maximum. This is a maximum size uh, uh, resident, normal, let me go back to it, a normal residential house. Uh, and obviously you have all these other ones here and they have bigger maximum populations but obviously yeah that doesn't depend on how many because I probably got a lot of parts around here actually stuff affecting it got a lot of education education is helping to boost uh, 77,053 more to the population okay anyway now that we know that Let's go ahead and do these upgrades. Now, what else do I have here? So, what do we got here? So, I can do these upgrades. And also, the pie. And great. So, those things are happening. What do we got here? Oh, another pie. You know, I had to search long and hard to actually find that. Uh, this is a cheesecake, actually. I had to search a while to find that. Now, I did want to go ahead and upgrade one of these Tokyo buildings while I can. And all I need is two. Let's see, is this for another upgrade? Uh, another notification? Yes. So now I need to probably try to find another light. Uh, but I think I will go ahead and put some ladders in. How long did it take for a light? Hour and 30 minutes. I could probably find the light. Uh, let's do that. Let's see if we can find a light bulb here. Oh, another cheesecake. We'll snatch this up. Oh, two. And a chair. Chairs are easy to make, but uh, sometimes you don't want to go through making them. You have to make the hammer, then I think you need two pieces of wood, but sometimes it just makes it easier to do that. All right, now where was that other place that needed a cheesecake? Oh, it was that epic deal here. Another point for that. All right. Um, hopefully I'm not looking down too much, guys. It's just because I have my recording device right here. I'll probably try to hold it up here so that I'm a little bit more connected to you guys at my camera right there. By the way, um, I wondered if you all, I, I sent, I, uh, in my group here, I did a little poll, informal poll. So I wondered if you all would watch uh, me play SimCity, the PC game, the one that came out in, I think, uh, the latest, eh, 2013, I think is when it came out. Uh, and then it's had expansions and stuff like that. Actually, I have it, and uh, I enjoy playing it. I've been playing SimCity a long time, as a matter of fact. As a matter of fact, at my home that I grew up in, I still have the PC box for SimCity 2000. Uh, but I played the SimCity before that, then there's the Sim SimCity 2000, and then I want to say there was SimCity 3000, maybe? And then there was SimCity 4. And then we have the this one, SimCity 5, but it was actually just titled SimCity. Came out about five years ago. So I wondered, hmm, is that a good, I probably should have, I mean, because I probably should have, I mean, it's hard, these are hard to come by. These textiles there, I shouldn't have, I don't think they're worth one epic point. That was a bad choice, guys. So in the comments, let me know if you would watch me play SimCity PC. It's kind of the same thing. The only thing with SimCity Build It is it's a casual game, and so therefore making content for it uh, can be a quite difficult because of things like this. Now I don't have anything to do. There's nothing to upgrade, right? I have to probably look for the next thing to do. 
So it's a kind of slow process. Whereas with the PC game, I can play and play and play and uh, until I can't play anymore. So that's pretty much where we're at with everything. There's that light bulb that we need. Hopefully no one grabbed it. Oh, and a beach item. Very good. I've been finding a lot of beach items, actually. I need them to upgrade my city. Let's buy some sugar, because uh, sugar and spices are also sometimes required, and they take five hours, I think, to make, so that's uh, kind of a long time. So all we're doing, guys, is just upgrading the city. Now, I guess what I wanted to do here in this video is... Uh, See if I can make some bread. Actually, I don't want to. I don't want to. This is too much for an upgrade. I'm going to switch. And get some new building plans. And did you guys know? Let me go ahead and show this. I can watch this little 30 second video clip here and speed up the uh, the time that it takes. For Sometimes I do download the games. They show a lot of games. I've actually downloaded quite a few games just based off of watching that. Okay, this is a little bit better. All we need is plastic and a hat. I saw a hat a while ago and I should have bought it for this purpose. Now, what do I need here? Uh, oh, just one piece of metal. So, this is almost about to be the end of this uh, low income housing area here that I had. They're getting upgraded now. Mayor Smith has been good to them on my promise to uh, bring jobs to the city and things like that. Let's see, should probably buy that table. Yeah, I, I just try to usually buy things and you never know, so you get other things. Those green smoothies are hard to come by as well. And chemicals too because a lot of things use chemicals and when you run out well you're out of luck for about two hours until you can make the next one so uh let's see what have they got here two green smoothies is that worth it though let me make sure none of my other upgrades needs green smoothies because uh i'd rather invest in an upgrade oh what have we got oh. okay maybe not how are those ladders coming? I thought I was supposed to have some ladders. Y'all working on those? What happened? Okay. Got to make a plank now. I'll try to speed things up for the video so you guys aren't waiting around all day. Uh, just watching. Alright, so I guess I will use those green smoothies. Uh, so what are we going for on this? I got 20 hours, already at 27. I think I need to get to, whoa, 80 to get a silver. That's a lot of time required for that. Uh, now, these here are actually premium buildings. All of these right here, these aren't the luxury buildings. Remember back here? These, Even though right now they fall under the orange luxury deal, they're actually premium homes. I just placed them in a zone that happens to be uh, luxury, meaning that if I upgraded within this zone, it would upgrade to a luxury skyscraper. But these are the premium skyscrapers, and I thought they looked good for this area. You probably heard me say this on a video before, but I, I think that they look good for that area. Uh, I used to live near the beach, and they had a bunch of buildings like this. These kind of like condos, some, you know, so I thought that they would look nice there. Now, as a contrast, I'm going to have to see what I want to do um, for the rest of this stuff. I think, and see, so this is what I was going to do, is just kind of move things around, kind of start getting this place upgraded. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I've got um, at least four buildings. I can place right over there. 
and kind of turn this into somewhat of a like a let's see where should I put this where would look good definitely on a corner let's see is that the right corner it's a tall building I think compared to I actually have another one that I could add right here if I wanted to but I don't know if I wanted two of those buildings right next to each other. Let's see how that looks. Um, uh, I guess it looks okay. Uh, what else do we have here? We got this building. I could go somewhere. I don't know, but that's basically what I want to do here is kind of move buildings around. And until... I'm satisfied with how they all look. I like this building here. That's the problem. Oh, I guess I got enough buildings already. Alright, well... What else did I got over here? So, I did want all of these. You know, the thing is, though, I got, like, a lot of the same looking buildings. And you guys know I hate that if you watch my videos at any time. I got one, two, three, four of the same, this blue building, which is a really nice building. However, not so much when there's, like, four of them in one block. And then these two, a nice building again, but lots of the same. So, I mean, I'm going to need some variety here. Colors, at least, or something. I can't go on uh, with this type of setup. All right. Well, I think that I need to make another one of these so that I can make a hat or something. Um, so, let's see. And I like this one here. So, what did I say I was going to do? I'm going to replace... See, actually move this over here with these other buildings. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with. And uh, this... Um, I'm to mix this up. Go right there. And then we're kind of stuck with the same looking buildings, kind of the same thing. Do I have any other any other buildings somewhere that are upgraded yet? E either one of these, whenever these upgrade. So what are the chances of me finding if I upgraded this one, I probably need to find that uh, bread, this bread here. What are the chances of me actually finding that right now in the um, deal? The chances are slim. Very slim. Very slim. I am going to buy this. Apparently they want me to upgrade my beach because I've been seeing a lot of beach items. TVs. Those are also kind of a hot item. Oh, lots of TVs. Six TVs, that should be enough for a rainy day. Any upgrades? Anybody asking for TVs over here? Nope. Alright, so yeah, I was going to do like a little downtown type of ish area here. Uh, type of thing. So that's, that's what's going to be happening over here. I'm thinking like all of this stuff would be these tall skyscrapers here. And I'll probably arrange them because I don't know if you guys know, but I did actually spend time uh, figuring out where I wanted to place each epic building to where it would look like. See, this wasn't a coincidence that these two are right next to each other. Neither was any of this stuff. These right here. I actually arranged this. These two right there, those two right there kind of complement each other. So, 
I do actually care where my buildings are placed. Now, where's those two ladders at? There's one. Let's see if we can get another one quick and fast throughout this video so that y'all can see the updated, I mean, the uh, completed, what, 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 what it is that we're going to get here as far as uh, Tokyo buildings. I think I was in the middle of moving. Let's see. Actually, let's see what colors would fit nicely there. I guess that's not too bad. So that's not too bad. I, I like that. And I probably won't upgrade this one. So let's just go to upgrade a different building with that. What do I want to put here? I could put more of these tall kind of buildings here, just keep on upgrading those. You know, kind of have a little, and uh, I don't know what this makes sense. Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm thinking like all these tall buildings surrounded by this kind of zoo looking, well, it's not a zoo, it's uh, just a uh, nature area that they didn't tear down. A bunch of protesters fought to keep it up, part of their neighborhood. But um, let's see. What? How can we? Let's see. How can we do another upgrade before the end of this video? My videos, I try to keep them around 30 minutes. So that's gonna take 30 minutes actually. Half of that. So I guess you guys will probably have to come back to the next video to see some of this get together. Uh, I am going to start working on a SimCity PC version series. So look out for that. Uh, we're going to just start from, you know, if you've never played the game, this will be a good series to watch. Uh, okay. Uh, I did want to show y'all though, if I can get this ladder done. What are we what are we looking at with the ladder guys? Hadn't started yet. Let's see if we can find a ladder in here while we wait on a ladder to process. None there. How long are we actually gonna have to wait? Let's see. Right, that's almost done four times so that's moving pretty quick that'll be done in like 25 seconds uh, 50 seconds and uh, then then we'll have a ladder ladder is 48 minutes that'll be 12 minutes wonder how much that would cost a gym I really did want to show this in the video but I'm not gonna be just talking my head off for another 12 minutes so and I don't have a lot of gems either, so I don't know. May not be able to see this unless we can find a, uh, unless we can find a um, uh, ladder. Now, I did want to start this. Won't waste any more speed up tokens. Can I collect any more? I have a few silver buildings here, here and there somewhere. Mm. So let me just talk about uh, future plans for my city. I'm going to be moving some things around. I want to move around this whole area here. And let me know if you guys think this is a good idea. But this Wild West type of thing I have here, it seemed like a good idea at the time. And it still may be a good idea. Stage coaches and stuff in the middle. Still may be okay. The idea was this is the historic part of the city. So... Uh, we're going to keep it historic, and we're not going to touch it. That's kind of with, ooh, fires. I guess we should move these to a place where they are uh, not under the potential of getting caught on fire. Anyway, um, so what I was basically saying is that uh, I want to consider possibly moving the just the wild west part of it to over here in this corner kind of like 
out of the way, for lack of a better term, because um, I don't know how it's going to flow with the city. It's just like when they gave us those buildings, those like, uh, what are those buildings? Hold on, let me find them, because I actually have some of them. Uh, what were they under? I think they're under landmarks. These buildings here, these uh, that we got for Contest of Mayor season, these season exclusive buildings, I got a few of them. I don't know how the uh, Hanging Garden of Babylon will look in the middle of my particular city. Now, I have seen some where it looks okay. I have seen some cities where it looks okay, not a problem. But I'm just not finding a, a place for it in my city. So, you know, some of these buildings that we get... Sounds like someone's at the door. Some of these uh, buildings that we get, I don't have much to do with them. So, that's just me. It's just my preference. All right, what can we do here? The ladder, have we put it in? The ladder is in production. It's gonna take us 12 minutes. Now, if we gemmed it here, just for the folks in the video, it would only be 14. Uh, let's have one more look, guys. Okay, there's motion at my door, yes. Uh, let's have one more look, and then we're just gonna go ahead and gym it. Guys, just for you, I'm gonna spend my precious sim cash. Just so we can see how uh, this all looks. So, before we do this upgrade, of course, we want to make sure that this is going to produce a luxury Tokyo building. And let's watch this. This is going to be the end, guys. So, don't ask for any more after this. Uh, okay. Let's see. Oh, it appears I could get a bonsai plant. Oh, that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and let's try to get a bonsai plant. Put these into production here. Two more of those. And what else? Bread? Yeah. 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 Hopefully I remember to check back in. All right. Here we go. Just taking a close-up look at everything that's going down. Parades and all. Why are people moving out? Talking about no fire safety. There's plenty of fire safety. Yeah, I don't know why they're saying that. Alright, let's see. Oh, here's our building. Now, is this different than the other one? Oh, good, it is. Well, that's not too bad. Let's, uh... I got this little random building here. And let's move this next to the other Tokyo building. Alright, that doesn't look too bad. Not bad at all. Alright, guys. Well, that's it. I'm glad y'all got to see that live and direct. And uh, we were right at the cutoff point for most of my videos. 29 minutes. And... Uh, We'll be coming up on the 30 minute mark here in a minute. So the next thing to expect from me, if I uh, don't get to the PC game beforehand, is just more upgrades of this city. It actually takes a while unless I just play the game for six hours straight. But it actually takes a while to get upgrades ready and going and this and that. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, comment below. Uh, on things and uh, you know tell your friends to subscribe here not worth it not worth it all right so see you guys later peace